We're gonna do a workout from the program Combat Kettlebell. We're gonna do week three, day one. So today we're gonna go single arm deadlift, mixed in with the single leg glute bridge. Then we're gonna move on to a goblet squat and move into some single leg work where we're gonna go kettlebell front rack lunge. We'll do a walking lunge there. Then we'll mix that in with a kettlebell hip shift, right? Hitting the glute med adductors. And then we're gonna finish off with conditioning, a lactic capacity work, kettlebell swings 12 by 10 every minute on the minute for the entire 10 minutes. All right, let's get into it. Shoulder width and then at the shoulder level. Go about uh right, I was like hip width on this one. Mm -hmm. And what I want you to do is kick the legs or kick the, the hips back okay. and open the chest up. Get a hinge, stretch on the hamstring a little bit, open up the shoulders, keep it back flat. Hold it. And back up, squeeze the loose. So we'll inhale, come down and then exhale. wide, open up. So you're gonna go from kind of like this externally rotated shoulder position, then bring it through into internal rotation. And you open up and protract the shoulder. Now watch, maintaining this position because I want your adults to stay on. Try to keep your hip on the wall as much as you can without actually falling over. Now open up, and then bring it through, and then reach. For the proper warm up, you wanna make sure that you're doing those main things of ramp, right? We talk about ramp, basically means range of motion, right? Activation, mobilization, and potentiation. And potentiation could be anything that you need to get your body ready for, for the work ahead. So this is gonna be important. If you watch any of Coach Griff's videos when we go to the track, it's the same concept, right? We're doing things that are going to potentiate into the actual work. So whether it be weight training, whether it be combat sports, you want to start to move around, maybe doing some technical drilling or just some shadow boxing. And that's what you want to do to get you ready for either sparring or something of that nature when it comes down to skills training. Lifting up and stick, and stick, and let it flow. Let it flow. Good, a little bit less, a little bit less. There you go. There you go. Good. It's gonna be a quarter squat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because when we're about to hit a deadlift, <clears throat> we're gonna go through swing variations too. Okay. So I want you to really get used to getting that hinge position, getting that triple extension too as well. Because okay. when we do the kettlebell swings, I'm gonna add triple extensions. So we're not just gonna do a regular swing. Okay. We're gonna do six sets of triple extension, or six sets of regular, six sets of triple extension. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so this one now, we're just going to drift and go 90 degrees to turn. So you're here. Good. Like less than this. Okay. Get your hips back a little bit more. Less of a knee. There, that's where you want to be. Right there. Right there. Let the arms flow. So you're going to be down. Up, on stick. Stick, stick, it's like a swing, stick. Keep the arm back like a swing. Let's go single leg, right? We'll go skater, we'll go 45 degrees, so oblique bound. And I want you to load the hips, so I'm gonna load, push off, load the hip. Stick, load the hip. Stick, load the hip. When we do like these hip shifts, 
right? You're in that skater position. Yeah. You have to shift side to side. Okay. So to help with lateral force and redirectional force, as long as you're in the right position, but if you're not in the right position, if you're too knee bendy, right, you're just going into the quad, you're gonna fall over. This time though, we'll go oblique to vertical, land on the same single leg. Push up, stick. Push up, and then get up. Control the leg. I'm getting my, just like you told me, in my sprints, get more of that. Yeah, because, if you can get the torso down more, I can get more hip involved. If I'm extended here, it's gonna be more. Okay. So I'm coming back here, right? Yeah. I got that lean like I'm gonna go run a 40, mm -hmm. right? And then I'm pushing off, but I'm pushing off, like if I was in a fight stand. Okay. So I'm pushing off more on the outside and inside of the ball of my foot. In the point of when we get vertical, are we mm -hmm. just working on fast weight? Yeah, I want to okay. see how well you can redirect force in a different pattern. See what I'm saying? Because in combat sports, like let's say I'm, if I'm going to shoot, so I'm going to shoot, I'm going to push off this backside leg. When I push off this backside leg, boom, even if I'm going to a knee or not, I still got to get a deep penetration shot. When I get here, I got to be able to redirect force now one way or the other, or get here to go up. See what I'm saying? So. It's that transition of forces with okay. that we have to be good at in a mixed modality sport like that. Boom, up, boom, now. get up, boom. Now do one, then we go to the other. Right, so here, push, boom, up, up. Oh. Now, you see like, I don't want you to drift this time. Okay. So you gotta stop your forward progression. So I think you straight vertical. vertical. Yeah, straight vertical. Okay. All right, so I'm glad to announce that I recently partnered with Merrick Health. Now, Merrick is an online health clinic that specializes in human optimization and wellness. Now, as an athlete, coach, and father that runs multiple businesses, things can get a little hectic, pushed to the side, and my health did start to decline. Now, I was at a point where I started to feel lethargic, tired all the time, not recovering from workouts, and that's a problem when you're trying to elevate and get the job done. I know I needed to change. I know I needed to find out what was completely going on from the inside out at a deeper level. Now, as far as my athletes go, I make it a requirement to get their lab work done before any training camp starts. So it was my time to do it for myself because if I can't do it for myself, I can't help others. So the importance of understanding where your levels are and what needs to be improved will drastically increase not only your recoverability, but your quality of life. Now, I could have partnered with anyone and trust me, they all came up, but I decided to go with Merrick because not only were they professional, but they were meticulous on their approach to getting the information necessary to me for a quality intervention that will provide me with better health overall. Now, truthfully, if you're feeling run down, experiencing brain fog like myself, having trouble sleeping at night, or just simply not recovering from your workouts, getting an in-depth understanding of your blood work is highly recommended. So you can now purchase your labs and a complete analysis review, which will provide you with a complete breakdown of all of your levels with a qualified code. Along with that, you'll get over-the-counter options and a potential prescription treatment recommendation. Just click the link in the description and use the discount code Daru at your checkout to save 10% on your first lab order. All right, let's get back to the video. I've been, I've been in the, all my gyms are warehouse. That shit yeah, actually I'll, is delicious. That shit. 
Yeah, it does. Yeah, that's good stuff. What, what is this? Pulse. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, got, like, I thought this dude just gave me caffeine. Yeah, it's good. Maybe. Go get like nine different ingredients yeah, home, bro. that home, make bro. up that thing, and you have to buy nine different bottles, or you could just get battle tested, which has every single one of those ingredients in it. Isn't that right? It's my hitters, man. See? <laughs> Everybody sells me. Everybody's a salesman around here. It didn't look like this when I met Phil. That's what he was Got on battle test as a transformer. All right, that's it. Combat Kettlebell is out now. Link is in the description. Coach Wyatt Griffith. Coach Wyatt Griffith. That's it on IG. Baby. On IG. Go check him out, man. See you guys next time. Peace. Get him. Bye.